think that they have become parents. Superintendents and principals think that they have become parents. Look no further than the Dalton School in New York, where parents are paying $55,000 a year for their kids to go to school to be shown a cartoon, six-year-olds, a cartoon where private parts are mentioned and self-pleasure to six-year-olds, and they're paying for this garbage. And then you go over to Loudoun County, and they can't even speak out. It's amazing. Well, you know, they wanted to speak out on critical race theory and the transgender policies. And the amazing part of it is that these school board members are elected. It's almost as though, I mean, we saw it with some of the governors. They become totalitarian and they become dictators. They are not to be spoken to. And yet it seems that more and more, I think the public is understanding the need to get involved in school board elections as well as all of the local elections. Now, what do you know about the, the, the fact that these teachers shut down the meeting? Up to that point, all the parents seem to be in agreement. How could they shut down the meeting? I guess they heard something they didn't like and just said, hey, this is an unlawful assembly. They declared it as such and then pushed the parents out of the room. And I mean, this comes on the heels of in Loudoun County. We know that teacher Tanner Cross was uh, suspended for sharing his religious beliefs only to be reinstated by a judge. This comes after a Christian family said, I don't want my child to be a part of a transgender lesson. So they put this child in what resembled a broom closet 